Right, we're rolling by the way. Those were big boys. Uh, we've got our patient, Master J. Master J. Master J is your nickname. Okay. Oh, close, thank you. Master J, you've got a cyst on your scalp. How long you had it? Probably 10 years. 10 years, give or take. Okay. And has it ever drained or anything like that? Never. Gumby no. Jean has done a little bit of barbering on us uh, here. Could I have an uh, alcohol swab, please, ma'am? Yes, sir. So we are going to remove this for you today on this uh, beautiful Friday before Christmas. We had one out that we took out earlier that was just beautiful. And so now we're going to do a second one. Actually, it was starting to bleed a little bit there. Could I, do we have uh, like a wet gauze that mm -hmm. I could use? Let me use that over there. Just clean that up a little bit for me. There we go, perfect. That one, I, I thought it was going to end up bleeding a lot. It didn't. All right, I am ready. So we're ready for uh, sis number two. How about you? Hey, that rhymed. Right here, Gummy Jean. A little cold spray. What's he going to feel? Sixteen and a burn. There we go. Here it comes. Just like the last one. 1% 1 lidocaine with epinephrine. Going in. Nice and slow. I think you froze the needle. Sorry. Oh, you're fine. Did you feel that sting just then? Just slightly. Good. We're going in. Actually, Gumby Jean, I don't think we're going to need a, a second uh, dose of medicine on this one either. No. I thought Master J was bringing us uh, a monster system. Something. Something, mm -hmm. yeah. Something that we could sell on eBay, mm -hmm. you know? <laughs> but that's okay. We'll take what we've got here. Okay, we're going to give it just a moment for that to work. We have 15 blade. Good. So do you want to tell us all what you got your darling wife for Christmas? Uh, what, I can't even remember. Oh, we remember, uh, I remember got her. I got her, her, I got her a swing for our uh, our vacation home. Oh, did you really? Out for a swing, and you know it was one of those said easy assembly, and, ah. which means that it took about two days. Yeah, and that's always a lie. Yeah. Used to they would say some assembly required. Some assembly required. That was a little bit more food, honest. Yeah. Yeah. yeah so. Uh, that and a couple of other uh, odds and ends. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I was worried that her mother would be coming down for Christmas. That was worrying you? Yeah. Uh. Kind of like that fella, I don't know if you've heard, that didn't feel good, so he went to the doctor and they ran a battery of tests on him. The doctor came out after about three hours and said, Well, I have some bad news for you. Mm -hmm. And she said, well, What is it? And he said, you have a rare and curable disease, and only have six months to live. Mm. I think, <clears throat> yeah. Uh -huh. And the guy said, well, I guess I'll move in with my mother-in-law. <laughs> the doctor said, now, why would you do that? He said, because I've only got six it? months, I want to be the longest six months of my life. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm not laughing at that. That's that not very, that way. was very mean. Although that, that was, was very mean. No, it was great. It was hysterical. All right, we're going to make a little incision. Are you ready? Go we're going to be using a 15 blade for this one. Right there, that should be plenty big. We don't want to get too big with these, but we want to be sure that it's large. Did you feel anything? Nothing. You're just moving around to be moving around, aren't you? And we have our curved hemostat. And we're going to open this up a little bit so we can see Mr. Cyst. Master J and Mr. Cyst. We're very formal today, Gumby Jean. I know. I wonder why. There it is. Can you see it coming in? Mm hmm. It's pretty cool, I think. <sighs> I'm ready for the Christmas vacation. How about you? Me too. Although it's not long enough, but I can't complain because I just came back from a two month vacation. Yeah, well, that wasn't really a vacation. I don't see. I think if you're out with back surgery, well, that doesn't really okay. count as a vacation, does it? No, it was the worst two months. Yeah, that's no fun. I mean, vacation ought to be fun. I think there's a law. I agree. I think there's some kind of law that, oh, you had the scissors. Good, thank you. I was reaching. Hair clipping scissors. Those were the other ones. I was reaching for them again. So we're going to use the scissors and we're going to just push in and we're going to open the scissors up to sort of spread the tissue gently around the cyst, make it easier for the cyst to come out. If we start seeing gray matter, well, then you know that 
We went a little bit deep, right? You know what I always say, a laughing patient's a breathing patient, right? I think that's it. <laughs> mm -hmm. She said I had a pulse earlier. Did she really? Mm -hmm. Well, that was nice of her. have to do Christmas shopping this weekend. Do you? I haven't done any. Oh my goodness. I don't know how much Christmas shopping I've done because I don't You do don't it. have Christmas shop. I'm a lousy shopper. Besides, when you're married oh, to such an, if you're married to an awesome shopper, why wouldn't you have them do the shopping, right? There's yes. that sis coming right up. A little bit of pressure there. Get that sis up where we can see him. Look at that, isn't that something? And tease that little pilar cyst right out. Master J, you, sir, are a connoisseur. I wouldn't say connoisseur. That'd be like a collector. You are an artiste, a renaissance man when it comes to the production of beautiful <laughs> pilar cysts. Oh, that one opened up, didn't it? Mm -hmm. This one was not as nice and clean as the other one was. Hey, Rip. This one, though, we have a nice little squeeze out on. Look at that. Trade with me. Thank you, ma'am. There he is, right there. Mr. Cyst. There it is. Coming out like you should. Look at that gun, Oh, he keeps springing free. He doesn't want to come out. He likes living inside of you. Inside your head. It's nice and warm in there, apparently. You know, this time of year. That's not a bad deal, right? Okay. Sounds like Houston. Yeah, right? Did you get it? You know, he's not cooperating very well with me. He's, he's uh, not coming out in one piece the way I like. And that's probably because I didn't do something that I should have done or who knows what, but I'll find a way to blame myself. I'll get them all out, don't worry about that. Look at that. Yeah, I think it was bigger than I thought. Mm. And that's why, uh, bigger yes. than it looked, right? That's why it broke apart. Yeah, now, so we have the whole cyst. So you can see the bottom of the sack right mm -hmm. there. The top just came open. That hop opened up. And I got some hair. Here we go. Now we're gonna come on out like we should. If you lose a piece of hair, let me know if you feel it. There we are. There. And that's the whole cyst, so there's nothing left. And that was actually pretty interesting. I just need a wet gauze, please. Yeah. You are cyst free. That's the wet one, thank you. Have a smooth noggin they give? Yeah, sort of. You know, we just push on a little bit, make sure that we don't have any residual debris. We don't. And um, I'll make sure that we wipe that off. There we go. So we just have a little, can I get those curved forceps again? We just have a little piece of connective tissue there. I just want to remove it just for completion's sake. I don't think it's cyst, but let's be sure we don't. I see that's just connective tissue. Okay, so we're good. Let's go ahead and get our stitch in. <laughs> Slap. <laughs> good job. Gummy Jean saved my stitch. You don't waste stuff around here. No, no, no. I get, since I threw Me. my other four by fours on the floor, could I have? <laughs> yes, I'm getting more now. <laughs> Thank you. We're just throwing things around, you know. We're trying to get out of here, so. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, four o'clock on a Friday, you need to get the hell out of here. <laughs> yeah, because we usually leave at noon. It's uh, yeah. bourbon, bourbon time. You know what, I'm going to get some tonight. Are you going to get some bourbon? I am. So this will be just one stitch, too, like the other one. 
and uh, these will both come out in about, what did I do? I lost my stitch. There it is right there. I couldn't see it. For some reason, it matched the color of your hair. It still does. There it is jet right there. Flavor. Yes, no, yeah. it's beautiful. Absolutely jet black, thick, healthy hair. Nope, salt at all. No salt at all. No gray fox. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, that squeaked. Did you hear that squeaky one? Okay, a little cut. Can I be Jean? Yes, sir. I believe he's all yours now. Let me just right. take a quick look, make sure I'm happy with that. My friend, you have successfully been desistified. <laughs> also, oh, no, 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 we'll, we'll take oh, that all off oh, real okay. quick here. And uh, right. you can have your uh, darling spouse remove these stitches from there in a week or so, or come back here if you're, right. if you're bored. <laughs> all right. No okay. Just, Thank you so much. Hey, folks, you spoke and we listened. Here's what you had to say about Meta 7. I love it so much. It gives me so much energy during the day. I've noticed a change in my hair, my nails, my blood pressure. There's no doubt that it, it's, it's a benefit to me. It gives me more stamina. And it can actually help you lose weight. Now, I haven't taken a nap in six months. That's right, Meta 7. More and more people are sending in their testimonials. Weight loss, more energy, and generally feeling more alert during the day. Let's hear more. I used it to help wean myself off caffeine and energy drinks, and my productivity has been very high lately. It's natural, it's amazing. I feel motivated to get out and do things that I didn't before. I'm not tired during the day. I've worked 12 hour shifts. I just go, go, go all day. It makes me feel great, I love it, and um, take it. It's wonderful stuff. If you haven't tried Meta7 yet, it's time to order yours from Amazon. Time to boost your metabolism and kick your energy level into high gear. There's an Amazon link in the description.